Hello there and welcome to day four of the Narrow Your Niche Challenge. I am Alicia J, your host here from NewVAAdvice.com, where I help virtual assistants create a business that they love with my business marketing and mindset coaching. So we are on day four, which is the last day of the challenge. Let me give you a little bit of an overview on what we did so far. So the first thing we talked about was narrowing your niche and specializing why it's important to either choose specializing in services, what you do, or your market, who you do it for. In day two, we talked about how to de determine the skill set that you have and turn it into services that people want to pay you for. In day three, we talked about how to decide on your target market. Now here on day four, we're going to kind of tie all of that together. We're going to talk about creating an intro statement that you can use so that you can confidently tell people what you do. Okay. So why is it important to have a piece like this, an intro statement? Where can you use it? Let me give you some ideas here before we get into the actual statement and the formula for it. So Think about networking events. If you go to online or offline networking events where you're in a room full of people and you need to introduce yourself uh, and tell them who you are and what you do. So it might be a one on one thing where you're meeting someone and talking to them or you may be presented with the opportunity to speak in front of the entire group and tell them more about yourself. You can use your intro statement. Maybe you are looking for referrals from other people. You want you have a referral partner relationship you'd like to strike up with someone. If you give them your intro statement, it makes it very clear what you do and who you're looking to be connected with. You can also use it in your marketing. So this would be on your website and in social media, brochures, business cards, anything you use to market your business. Pieces of your intro statement will help clearly explain what you do and who you do it for. Okay, so I'm going to show you the formula in a minute, but let me break down the pieces that are in it, pieces that you need to make it work. You need to have who you are in there, who you serve, how you do that, and then the benefit to them. Okay, so let me show you the formula. And I'm going to hold it up here, my handy dandy flashcard. Hopefully you can see it here. So just so you know, if you are an official member of the Narrow Your Niche Challenge, you will get this information in your email and on a worksheet for day four. So you don't need to worry about saving this right now uh, or trying to write it down really fast while you're watching the video. OK, so you're going to get this information. I'm going to read off to you what it says. Let me move it up here so you can see it. And then um, I'm going to give you some examples of how you can plug in pieces to make this formula work. OK, so it says, hi, I'm your name here and I love to help support or serve whichever word you feel fits better with what you do. And then you name your target market who are struggling with their pain point. With my insert your services here, I help them and then the benefits or the outcome of what you do for them. OK, so I'm going to continue to hold this up for a minute while I give you a couple of examples. The first one, uh, let's say I'm going to fill this out for myself and my business right now. So keep in mind as I'm reading off to plug into the formula to see how it works. OK, so I would say, hi, I'm Alicia and I love to help new virtual assistants who are struggling with feeling overwhelmed and confused with all there is to do in order to set up their business and get clients. With my private and group coaching programs, as well as other products, I help them gain clarity and take steps towards creating the virtual assistant business of their dreams. OK, so you see how I plugged in the pieces. I'm going to give you two more examples of maybe VAs who would use this formula. OK. Hi, I'm Mary and I support business coaches who are struggling with getting known and being seen online. I utilize my social media expertise to simplify the process for them and get them in front of their ideal clients. I have one more for you. I have notes so I don't forget to tell you anything. Hi, I'm Sue and I love to help health and wellness experts who are struggling with expanding their message. With my transcription services, I help them repurpose their existing content into blog posts, info products and other valuable content so that they can reach more people in their target market. OK, so those are some examples on how to use it. Now, like I said, you don't have to worry about writing all this down right now. If you're a member of the challenge, you're going to get that information on your day four worksheet. OK, and a chance for you to work it out yourself. 
So the other thing I want to tell you about this intro statement is it doesn't have to be perfect and it's not going to be the first time you make it. And it's something that's fluid. It's going to change and evolve over time as your business changes and evolves. And that's okay for right now. It's just a tool I want you to start to use to kind of get in the zone and get familiar with telling people really what you do and being really clear about it. Okay. Um, I've also had people ask me before, does this help you come up with your USP, your unique selling proposition? And yes, it does. You can use the formula to plug in pieces that say what's unique to you and your business and how you do things. You can also use a shortened version as a tagline or a short intro for videos, just like I do. I mean, think about when I started out this video, I said, um, that I was Alicia J from NewVAAdvice.com, and that I offer business marketing and mindset coaching to help virtual assistants create a business that they love. So that's really a shortened version of this intro statement. Okay, so it's very flexible. It's very fluid. I really just wanted to give you something, a tool that you can use to start working on to build that confidence. It's not necessarily something you have to memorize word for word, but the more you use it and practice it, the more comfortable you're going to get telling people confidently what you do and who you do it for. Okay. So obviously your action step for this day would be to work on that intro statement and come into the Facebook group and then tell me um, what you've come up with or ask questions if you want some help or guidance on how to do that. That's a great place to do that in the Facebook group thread. Um, now, this is the end of the challenge, but I did want to talk to you about that because I'm a little sad, but I'm also excited because if you felt that you got something out of this and you want to work more with me or on these pieces that you've worked on in the challenge, I would love to invite you to do that. So first of all, I love running challenges like this because I like giving people real actionable steps they can take in order to move forward with their business. And I love seeing the aha moments that everyone has, right? And you write and you tell me uh, in an email or in the Facebook posts, and I can see, you know, light bulb moments and things are happening for you and the pieces are fitting together. And I love that. So with that being said, if you want to do more of that and you want to do that with me and a group of other like-minded people, I invite you to join me in the next round that I'm running of the VA Biz Foundation Group Program. I will hold up the link here for you with another awesome flashcard. And then let me tell you a little bit more about it. Okay. So basically the VA biz foundation group program is based on the one-on-one -on -one work that I do with clients, but it's in a small group setting and it's at a much more affordable, lower price point. Okay. So the things we covered are a lot of what we did in this challenge today, but we go into a lot more detail and you get me by your side to kind of go through that process with you. Okay. So let me give you an idea of the kinds of things that we cover in the group program. We can talk about mindset because you know, it's very different to think like an entrepreneur and own your own business versus thinking and working like an employee. Okay. Um, we can talk about creating a schedule that works for you in your life. Um, a lot of people going through this program are still working a full-time job with the dream of someday running their VA business full-time, but it's just, you know, you're just starting out. You're not there yet. So you need to juggle things like family and other responsibilities and work and maybe volunteer or kids. Um, and I get it. And it's a lot to figure out. So we can use some time in the program to help you figure out a schedule that works for you. Now, another big part of it is figuring out your services and your target market, which is what this challenge was really based on. But again, we'd really go into detail and fine tune that just for you. And then the last piece that we can cover, which is a big help to a lot of people in the program, is actually talking about what you're charging for the services and how you're putting that out there to the world. I know this is a really tough piece. People get really stuck on that, and it often prevents them from even setting up their business um, because it's, it's tough. It's, it's a taboo topic. You can't just go out there everywhere and ask people, tell me what to charge. Okay. So this is a safe place to do it in the group program. Um, what else do I want to tell you about it? It is a five week program. And if you're part of the challenge here, that means that another round is starting soon. 
So check your email that came with this video and it will also include some bonuses for you if you choose to sign up now. I love giving extra bonus things to people, especially when they've gone through a challenge like this with me. So open your email and find out what the challenge is for you that will be available for a limited time before the group program starts. It will give you details like the bonuses and start dates and pricing and if there are any deals on that as well. Okay, so check your email that came with day four challenge. Um, what are you going to get out of this group program? When you're finished, I want you to walk away with confidence and clarity in your business. I want you to be confident to say, yes, this is what I do. And these are the services that I provide. And this is the market I want to go after. This is what I'm charging. And I feel good about this. I want you to be finished and have a solid foundation for that business. So then you can move on to the marketing aspect and market and get clients that make sense for you. These are the pieces that people often skip and they want to jump right to the getting clients phase. But I promise you, if you don't do this foundational business building, you're going to feel very lost and confused. You're going to be sending mixed messages to people and you're not going to bring in clients that you want. OK, so again, the link is newvaadvice.com forward slash VA hyphen biz hyphen foundation. OK, so when you go to that page, what happens? What's the process? Well, the page will tell you more about the program itself um, and the fact that we can focus on any of these pieces that you need to. And I'll help you figure that out, too, if you're not sure where you need to be focusing right now. Um, there will also be a link on the page that says click here, sign up today. It's a clickable button. Uh, when you do that, it's going to take you to a page to schedule a call with me. Why do I do that? Well, I really want to make sure this is a good fit for you, that you and I are good fit to work together, but also that this is where you should be right now in building your business because I want it to be successful for you. OK, so you'll see when you click through, if you click on the sign up today button, it's going to get you to call me. We will talk about it if you're a good fit. I'll send you the information to sign up. Uh, you'll get your bonuses and a payment link and information on when the next session is starting and how to get in. OK, um, you're also going to get information on the other pieces in the program. Like we have a private Facebook group and it's just for me and you and the other group members to ask whatever you want in there and to feel safe doing so. You get access to a resources page where I give group members um, pretty much any of my products that I feel are going to benefit you going through this process right now. So it could be an ebook or an audio or a worksheet, whatever I feel might help you. You're going to get all of that in the resources area. Um, you're going to get a weekly call with me and the other group members. We're going to do it once a week. It will be recorded. I usually schedule these in the evenings because a lot of people are still working their full time job who are taking this program. But again, if you can't make the call, it's going to be recorded. What are the calls for? This is your accountability time. This is your Q&A time. Come in and tell me this is what I'm working on. This is where I'm stuck. What do you think of this? Can someone look over that? Can I get advice on this? Where should I be with this? OK, that's your time, your time to ask questions and get them answered so that you can really move forward. OK, so like I said, this is going to be starting soon if you're a part of this challenge and watching this video. And I would really love you to be part of that small group experience and see what that feels like for you. People who have gone through this program before have told me that being able to do this with a group of other people going through it was just exactly what they needed. They were able to build their confidence. Uh, someone else might have asked a question that they didn't even think of, but they benefited from hearing the answer. And they developed relationships from these people with these people in the group and continued those on after the group program. Um, everyone in the last session did a great job of putting the pieces together to build the foundation of their businesses and have gone on to market and get clients for that business. So it's very exciting for me to see. It's very rewarding for me to be able to work with people like this. And I would love one of those people to be you. OK, so for more information, check this link, newvaadvice.com forward slash VA dash biz dash foundation. And we'll talk more about it. So let me remind you of your action steps, because this is our last day of the challenge. You're going to go into day four post in the Facebook group in the Virtual Assistant Empowerment Facebook group and tell us your intro statement or ask questions to get clearer on that. And if you feel like this was great and you know you have more work to do and you want to do that with me and other like minded people, then I invite you to join us for the VA Biz Foundation group program. OK, so either way. 
I just want to tell you thank you and I love doing challenges like this and spending this time with you. I hope that you've had some aha moments that have helped you move forward and um, kind of like what I always say to people is whatever you choose to do after this challenge, just take that one next step towards building the business that you love, whatever that might be for you. Maybe it's to continue uh, some training that you want to do or hone in on your market better or get that website set up or go through the materials that you had in this challenge and take action on them or sign up for the VA Biz Foundation Group program. Whatever that is, take that one next step for you. And if it is the program, think about it this way. In the five weeks, because that's all it is, it's a five-week program, think about where you could be from there. You could walk away from there feeling so good about your business, having it set up and getting ready to take clients on. Okay. So I just want you to keep that in mind. All right. Well, that is it for me today here at new VA advice. And that is it for the narrow your niche challenge. I hope that you enjoyed this and got something valuable out of it. I very much looking forward to continuing our relationship, whether it's in the group program, or I can see you over at newvaadvice.com or show up and be active in the virtual assistant empowerment Facebook group. I love that. And I love connecting with you there, whatever you do, have a great day and we'll talk soon. Bye-bye.